Yep. I also want to ask you about the Human Powered Travel and Wilderness Areas Act, S-1695. So another approach to solving some of the access issues at BST is to ease the nationwide ban on bicycles inside of wilderness. This bill that I introduced, S-1695, uh, the, the Human Powered Travel, Travel in Wilderness Areas Act, would amend the Wilderness Act of 1964 to authorize local land managers to determine on a case-by-case -case basis where and whether to allow mountain bikes to access wilderness. Um, and uh, I, I'd like to thank you, Mr. French, and also you, uh, Mr. Ned, uh, and your respective departments and agencies for your support of this bill. You know, I've heard some concerns that the bill, according to some, would, would uh, authorize new roads in wilderness. Mr. Ned, can you confirm that my bill would not allow for new roads? Yes, Mr. Chairman, that is my understanding. The bill would allow just for the existing, but existing pattern road would, would not allow for use of new roads. And would the department seek public input before deciding on the suitability of a trail for other types of motorized travel? Well, my understanding, there's two years for the federal manager at the local level, so that process would include seeking input from stakeholders. Okay. Mr. French, how prominent has mountain biking become on national forest system lands compared to the 1960s when logging was a more dominant use? It's, it's a tremendous use. Um, Three out of every four miles of trail right now that we have, it's like 120,000 miles uh, currently are open to mountain biking, and we see increased use year after year. It's a dominant uh, ex expanding use. Now, is the ban on mountain bikes contained in and directed by the Wilderness Act? And, and if it's not, could the Forest Service change its regulations on bicycles if it, if it decided to do so? Um, our advice and interpretation from our attorneys is that the Wilderness Act specifically calls out mechanized, not allowing mechanized, and there is uh, some court cases that support that, and that was the change in our regulations in the 80s that created that. The original understanding uh, at the time the Wilderness Act was enacted in 1964 did not encompass bicycles. Is that correct? Um, sir, I'd have to get back with you. I, I, I know the language in 1964 specifically called out not using mechanized right. um, transportation. Okay. See, my time's expired. 